The beautiful and unique Century Link Field is the home for this matchup between the Seahawks and the Seahawks. You know, when you get a matchup at running back, like the one we have here today, you can just look down on the field from the booth, and you can see that breakaway speed and power with your own eyes, and there is a difference out there. Yeah, I think you know, I, I was always, always heard from Bill Walsh. I read it in his book, Trust Your Eyes. So you're right. We look down the field today, and as this thing goes along, you can tell we have two stars at running back, and, man, just give them a little bit of hope, and they can make it happen. And a touchback. down as they head to the line. The give. Straight ahead. Second down now. They're setting up screen. A foot race to the end zone. He's at the 50, the 40. What a nice throw and catch that time, but here it just shows you why you want to have a lot of speed on the defensive side. So when you make a mistake, what do you do? You make up for it by chasing the player down from behind and making the tackle. After the long game, let's see what they do here. The defense doesn't want to give up runs like that, so how do they stop it? Well, they start crowding the line of scrimmage, so you keep crowding that line of scrimmage. Look out. They'll throw it over the top. Lynch is lined up in a single back formation. Here's the handoff to Marshawn Lynch. The offense has done a good job. They're now down inside the 20, but here's where it gets tough because your plays are limited because the field has been shrunk. First down, following the long play. Touchdown, Seahawks. Well, it's first to go. I think a lot of defenses are thinking run here, and so the offense, they call a nice play, very deceptive. They throw the football, and they get the easy touchdown pass. The Seahawks are in shape now to return the kick. Nothing like a good return when you talk about special teams. Good blocking, the speed of the returner gets down the field, and after that tackle, now they have good starting field position. It's a two tight end formation. To the ground here. Now slashing to the right side, looking for room. It's now second down. for a moment, but the ball is knocked out incomplete. You might as well catch it because you're going to take the big hit no matter what. That time, the receiver lets the ball go because he was worried about the defender making the hit. Third and seven. Throws the pass. On the money. That'll stop the play right there. Uh, there's nothing the defense can do. When you talk about a receiver like these guys out there now, and, and this one in particular, the double coverage, they're still able to go in between the defenders, rise up and make the catch. Good job on the ground there by Lynch. When you see long runs like that by a running back, a lot of things have to happen. Of course, he has good vision and he has talent, but how about those blocks down the field, those blocks in the secondary? That's what creates long runs. Second down. Halfway through this first quarter now. Brings it in. They pounce on him there. Nothing too exciting here. Just plowing ahead, getting closer to that goal line. Well, they're trying to find out if this defense has the courage. There's a signal from the far side. The hands are up. It is a touchdown. Oh, what a good job there by the offense. Third and goal. And what do they do? They run the football against the defense. And nice job getting the touchdown. 
Steven Hauschka ready for the kickoff. And he's brought to the ground. Wide receivers are bunched up. Quarterback tosses it to the outside. Good job by the defensive player squaring up that running back and just put his big butt right into the ground. Offense lines up here. Second down, two to go. Wide to the left. There's the tackle, but still, it's enough for the first down. The NFL is about situations. A good job by the runner knowing where the first down was, gets it there, and he moves those chains. Back to the ground. To the right. Got a little crease. Good job that time by the running back getting down the field and picking up big yards. Here's the first snap after the big play. Wilson's got the football after the play fake. And that's a big tackle behind the line of scrimmage. So many things you can do on first down, and what do you come up? You come up with that play. That was just a bad play call. Second down coming up. He'll fire it out to the left, and that ball's nearly picked off, but he dropped it. That's a nice route that time by the wide receiver running the corner route, and the quarterback just throws it too far and misses it. Harvin's lined up now as a slot receiver. Third and 11. Sticks to his hands. Good, solid tackle. Short of the first. And now we've got a fourth down situation. From the gun, Russell Wilson ready for the snap. Wilson's going to take it from the gun. Throwing now to his left. Tackles made. Well, it's always about risk and reward. It is a risk to go for it on fourth down. When you pick it up, you feel like a genius, don't you? First and ten. This is a screen play all the way. 25. Why not take one of the best players on your football team, the wide receiver, and throw him some screen passes? It makes sense. Good job. Nice yards picked up. That was a big gainer. Now it's time to back it up. And he's in for the touchdown. The fullback in most offenses in the NFL very seldom gets to carry the football. But down near the goal line, they serve a good purpose. Quick hitting plays by a big, powerful guy gets it done. Seahawks ready here for the kickoff. Across the 10, and that's about it. He's tackled at the 15-yard line. Marshawn Lynch is in the backfield. Makes the grab and keeps the ball moving down the field. That's a first down catch. How do you stop these receivers now? It's almost impossible with the rules of the game. Uh, tight coverage. That time they have double coverage on him. It doesn't matter. The throw comes. They go up, they make the catch. All you can do is raise your arm and go, well, we did our best. Offense lines up here. And the second quarter is underway with this snap. Lynch is in the backfield, single back set. That ball is going the other way. Brings the play to an end. Linebackers nowadays are so talented. They can just do everything. Uh, they're strong enough to stop the run. But how about this interception? Good job. Good reading of the quarterback and a nice pick. The quarterback will hand it off. And here he goes. A lot of ways to get plays in the NFL. It doesn't always have to be by a pass. Good job that time by the running back. Marshawn Lynch is in the backfield, leading on that running attack again here on first down. When you make play calls like that, you're not going to win many football games. That was a terrible call here on first down. Watch the, watch the blitz, watch the blitz. 
Russell Wilson has it under center. Screen pass. Reaches out and snatches it. He's brought down. Good job by the offense. Another first down. The defense absolutely is getting tired. And when you get tired, you make mistakes. Let's see what they do on first down following that huge play. The give. Touchdown. Seattle. How about that? The fullback scores the touchdown. He does all the blocking. Gets beat up all the time, but nothing like getting the football where you can score to get it done. The Seahawks are set to return the kickoff. And they have this return completely covered. Tackling them inside the 15. First down, Lynch. It's Earl Thomas who makes the tackle. Outside runs take time. And when you run outside, you expect the safety to get up there with that extra time and make the tackle. Good job that time by the safety. Marshawn Lynch is in the backfield. Russell Wilson out to Sidney Rice. This doesn't look good. We've got a player down and he's in pain. Well, that's going to hurt him tomorrow. There's no doubt about it. When you get hit like that, you're going to feel some of that pain tomorrow. But the good news is, I think he's going to be okay. And once he gets a little um, uh, situated there, I think he'll be back in the game. Good job that time by the running back. I'm sure he's a little winded after that play. He showed that speed getting out there and picking up those extra yards. First and 10. Looking for an open receiver on the right. Well, they complete the pass, Jim, but doesn't get the first down. Sooner or later, he got to throw one down the field. Now they'll try over again on second down. Got a big lane. Gains nine. Good job that time by the offense. Power run gets him a few yards. On the way, third down. The tackle's going to be made, but he's beyond the first down marker. Boy, they got a good drive going here, Jim. I guess you don't hear that too much on the golf course, do you? The way you hit it everywhere, but this offense, they're clicking, they're making plays. Let's see if they can take advantage of, of just moving this football down the field. The Seahawks come out in the pistol. Marshawn Lynch takes the football, and they tackle him there at the 34. Nice job that time by the defense. They were ready for the run, nowhere for the running back to go, and they stop him for a short game. Second down and nine. Brings it into his body. Oh, the, we've got an injured player on the field. I think you can just tell by the body language and the way he's acting, that is an upper body injury. Hope it's not severe. We'll let you know as soon as we find out. Third down here. Offense trying to pick up the first. Looking for a receiver on the left side here. Running play went for 11. This is where games are won and lost. Once an offense gets down the red zone, even though they're down more than seven, can you find a way to punch it in there for the touchdown and not settle for a field goal? They tackle him for a loss. Got to give the defense some credit. On first down, there's so many things the offense can do. They were ready for that play, and they stopped it. Danielle's got an injury update for us. Let's go to her now. Guys, I just spoke with a Seahawks official. The staff wasn't saying much about the injury other than it's not severe enough to keep him out of this one. So expect to see him back on the field shortly, guys. That is play number 10 on this drive. Russell Wilson will take it from the gun. Challenging the defenders to the right side. And it's incomplete. Just couldn't hold on to it after the hit. The 
This will be the 11th play of the drive. Wilson's going to take the snap from the shotgun. Throws to the right. Touchdown. That'll close the gap. Nothing like having a quarterback who has a good arm who can, who can just fire that football into some tight spots. And then it helps when your receiver has got the talent and the courage to go in there and make that tough catch. Steven Hauschka ready for the kickoff. Tackled just past the 20. We'll mark it at the 22-yard line. Wide receivers stacked up on this play. Quarterback flips it to the running back. When you run the football like this and you show toughness, there is no doubt when you fake it and try to throw the football down the field, the quarterback's going to have all day to get it done. Offense lines up here. Here's the handoff to Marshawn Lynch. And they bring it down at the 38-yard line. An off-tackle run, it's a staple of all offenses in the NFL. And a general rule is you run off the right tackle because he is the power tackle where the left tackle is the pass blocker. The off-tackle run, it's just what it says it is. You're going to read the tackle's block and decide whether you're going to go inside or outside. Usually, this is the first running play every team puts in their offense when they go to training camp. Let's just tell it like it is, Jim Nance. His receiver's not a very tough guy because he gets hit. It should have been a complete pass, but he gets hit. He just throws that football on the ground, and the pass is incomplete. They face third down after the incomplete pass. Wilson's got it in the gun. The Seahawks get a first down. The slam route made famous by the West Coast offense, something that really I thought came in the league when Bill Walsh started with the 49ers in 1979. A tackle behind the line. Well, the play is there to be made, but the offensive player doesn't get it done. Bad job on first down. Second and 12, setting up screen. Russell Wilson connects with Golden Tate. Nowhere else to go, and he's out of bounds. This is kind of new to the NFL the last four or five years. We're seeing more and more screens to wide receivers. Good timing, good execution, and good yards picked up. Lynch is lined up directly behind the quarterback here. He gets the toss, got the first, and he's got some space. And he's out of bounds. You know, when the linebackers, when they see that the offensive formation is shifted to one side, well, as a linebacker, you've got to play to that strong side and try to get up there and stop the run. New set of downs now after picking up the first on the ground. He's going to be swallowed up behind the line. Well, that time, the defense gets the tackle behind the line of scrimmage. Listen, I blame this one on the quarterback. When you see the defense in a situation like that, you must change the play. Don't waste one in the NFL. You don't get enough chances as it is, and that one lost yards. Marching down the field and taking their time. He makes the catch. Runs out of bounds. It's been a beautiful drive so far by this offense, Jim. They started in bad field position. Now they're inside the 20. Let's see if they can get it done from here. Offense heading to the line for the 11th play of the drive. Action fake. Complete. Seattle is in for the score. Touchdown. Well, it was a good job on that touchdown that time. And I tell you, there's nothing like being on top of the other team and make them chase you. Oh, he actually misses the point after. The Seahawks are in shape now to return the kick. That return ends rather quietly, short of the 20. Let's mark him at the 16. Lynch is out in the slot. First down and 10. 
Up the middle, running a little college-like option. He's brought down at the 23-yard line. This will probably be the last play of the first half. Second and three, wasting no time. Here's the toss to the outside. And that's going to do it for the first half. We'll be back from the Emerald City for the start of the second half in Seattle after the break. They're lining up for the onside kick. They want to get the ball back. The receiving team has the recovery. Offense lines up here. Second half gets rolling now as he takes the snap. Lynch with an impressive run. Well, when your team is behind, what do you do? Just come out there and get a first down. That's a nice job by the offense. Here they come, back to the line after picking up over 20 yards on that last play. Makes the catch in open space. Find a way to score. That's always the mantra with every team when they get in the red zone. If you punch it in here, even though you're down by more than seven, it'll give you confidence for the rest of the game. So, first and goal to go. He's going fast. And he breaks the plane. He breaks the plane. He's in for the touchdown. Ah, oh, you just love it as a quarterback. You get down in there and it's first and goal and you score. Now you don't have to sweat the fact that, man, what are we going to do if it gets to third down? You don't have to worry about it. Good run. Nice touchdown. The onside kick is turned away and the receiving team has it. Come to the line, and it's first down. Lynch, they break through, tackle it behind the line. Good job by the defense. They stopped the first down play that time by the offense, and now they have a good situation. Second and 12. Right where it had to be. Well, they call this route a lot of things. They call it a goal route, a nine route, or a fly route. And all of them mean the same thing. Run as fast as you can, get behind the defense. Running away from the pressure. Incompletion on that hurry throw. This defense you're playing against, they're pretty good. So it's fourth down near midfield, punt the football. to the left. There's a flag out. Gain of seven. That penalty is, of course, going to be accepted by the defense. The punter awaits the snap. Harvin will return the punt. Makes a move and gets around the defender. First down on the way. Marshawn Lynch takes the football. Has the first down. Now looking for more. Well, the long run that time, and there's a lot of reasons why they got that long run. But the, the biggest one 
the good blocking up front, but what patience for the running back. He did not panic because it took a while for that running lane to develop. When it did, he saw it, he hit it, and he used his talents to get down the field for the big game. Here comes the training staff as we've got a player down on the field. That's a good job. He's able to get up and get off the field. And my guess is he's going to be okay. A little bit of a scare there, no doubt about it. That makes everybody worse. First down by the offense inside the red zone. Can the defense show him something different here and keep him from scoring a touchdown? First and goal. They beat him the ball again. They knocked him down behind the line of scrimmage. Good job by the defense. They stopped the offense that time on first down. Now the defense is in a good situation. Second and goal from the five. The touchdown. Nice throw by the quarterback that time. Put it right on the money. Not a big window. It doesn't matter to him today. Great control of the football. Put it right in there for the touchdown. And the point after is good. They line up here for the onside kick. They want that football back. That kick came right at him, and it looks like the receiving team has recovered. Sean Lynch is in the backfield. And they're going to run it right. Nice run that time by the running back. And if they keep running the football like this, it's just a matter of time before they fake it and throw that football over the top of the defense. They are being physical. The running back doing a good job, and they are making it happen in the running game today. First down here after the run. Flip to the outside. He's brought down at the 30-yard line. Safeties now in the NFL have to cover like a corner, and they got to tackle like a linebacker. And that time, the safety came up, and he tackled like a linebacker and stopped that outside run. That was a running play that time by the offense. It picked up some good yards. Nothing like it. Show the defense you're willing to get in there and slug it out and get some tough running yards. Third and five. He's looking to the right here on this throw. When you get down in the red zone, the offensive coordinator's got to call a play that deceives the defense. Let's see if he can do it. His team is down. He needs a big play here. Here's the quick toss. They've got him behind the line of scrimmage. So many things you can do on first down, and what do you come up? You come up with that play. That was just a bad play call. Lynch is lined up now as the running back behind the quarterback. Right back to him one more time. That's a gain of eight. Someone's been injured out there. Hold on a minute. Well, that's going to hurt him tomorrow. There's no doubt about it. When you get hit like that, you're going to feel some of that pain tomorrow. But the good news is I think he's going to be okay. And once he gets a little um, uh, situated there, I think he'll be back in the game. Play number six coming up on this drive. Three-step drop. He'll throw it over the middle. Another third down conversion. The offense continues to come through in the clutch. Always a good job to pick up some yards when you're in the red zone. Nice throw by the quarterback, and he gets the completion. Takes it from the eye. When you make play calls like that, you're not going to win many football games. That was a terrible call here on first down. Coming up, second down. Three-step drop. Has it. Touchdown. Tight ends are so valuable down on the goal line. They're able to maneuver inside. Easy to get defenders to run into each other uh, to get open to score. The 
going to bypass the point after. And Trump got the touchdown, got the two-point conversion. People love to go for two in this game, don't they? Well, they do. And you know what? Now I guess you and I just can't sit here and blast the coach for a bad decision. When you pick up the two points, you can't complain about what they're trying to do. Muscles through the defender, and he's met head-on right there at the 20. This doesn't look good. We've got a player down, and he's in pain. That's a good job. He's able to get up and get off the field, and my guess is he's going to be okay. A little bit of a scare there, no doubt about it. That makes everybody nervous. Offense lines up here. Here's the handoff to Marshawn Lynch. Dragged to the ground. Looks like he's still about a yard short of the first. When you have a defense as fast as this one, they over-pursue. So that's why you want to run a counter run. Take advantage of the fact that they are just charging too fast, too hard, and not thinking on the defensive side. They're able to move the chains after that last run. Goes deep to Sidney Rice. There's a receiver there, and the catch is made. It's just not done enough, I think, in the league anymore. Everybody's so careful. But look what can happen. You can have the perfect throw, the perfect catch, and a big play. Lynch. Oh, we've got an injured player on the field. Always hard to guess what the injury is, but and don't like to speculate, but I think it's pretty apparent. It's an upper body injury. We'll let you know when we find out. Two tight ends. The final quarter underway now with this snap. Zone bound, and he's got the touchdown. Well, that score ties the game up. Now on the defensive side, you got to come out there and take advantage of this, this feeling you got going now and get the football back for your offense. The Seahawks now lined up for the extra point. An extra point is good. Seahawks ready here for the kickoff. And a touchback. <laughs> Lynch is lined up behind his quarterback as the single back. First and ten. Quarterback was under a lot of duress on that pass, and alas, it's incomplete. I, I listen, I know he was under duress, but you got to hit these type of throws in the NFL. You're not always going to get perfect protection. That's not a good job by the quarterback. After the incomplete pass, it brings up second down. Pass complete. Going to lose yards here. The quarterback should have never thrown at that time. Even though he completes the pass, he should have seen the defense was right there. A loss of a couple yards. This is third down. Got a little screen set up here. Makes the catch. Sometimes it's good protection by the offensive line, and sometimes it's just bad defense. They can't get to the quarterback, and that's another completion by him. That reception gave them the first down. Go run it off the toss. They've got him down there. And it'll be second down and six after the running play on first down. Looking to the right side and throwing. Oh, should have had it. All you have to do is watch the head of the receiver. 
When they drop footballs, usually it's because you can see their head move the other way before the football gets there. That's what happened this time, and it's a drop pass. Third down and six. As they go ground here, a tackle that had to be made, and that'll set up fourth down. Offense lines up here. Wilson from the shotgun, looking across the middle, and he hauls it in. Receivers get scared sometimes when they get slant route. They know their linebackers inside running towards them because they're watching the quarterback's eye. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. Another first down by the offense. The defense is definitely getting fatigued. And when you get fatigued, you cannot think, so look out. New set of downs now after picking up the first on the ground. Marshawn Lynch takes the football. Well, I know it's not going to make a highlight film, but still a good solid run up in there for a couple yards. Marshawn Lynch is in the backfield on second and nine. Here's the handoff to Marshawn Lynch. The outside linebacker that time just did his job very well and gets in there and makes the tackle for very little gain. What a drive this has been. Third and ten. He'll fire it out to the left. Almost intercepted that time. When you're going against a good quarterback and wide receiver in the NFL now, one of the ways to stop it is tight man-to-man -man coverage. You against him. The game is tied and time is a factor. Trying to work that left side. So that's not going to get it done here. And the offense is going to turn it over on downs. Well, they don't get it on fourth down. That was, man, that was a quick drive, wasn't it, Jim? That was just bad play calling, bad execution, and go to the sideline. That's where you deserve to be. Time is running out. The game is tied. And the defense must do whatever it can to not give up a score. Got to give the defense some credit. On first down, there's so many things the offense can do. They were ready for that play, and they stopped it. That leads us to second down. Quick drop back. I pass is intercepted. Nice tackle. Well, nowadays, your linebackers, they've got to be able to do everything. They've got to be big enough to get in there and stop the run, and also athletic enough to be able to get in position and make an interception. Good job by the linebacker. First down here. Quarterback, quick toss to the outside. And tackled down at the 43-yard line. Good coaching on the defensive side. Everybody stays at home. They stay in their gap, and they hold that run to a short game. Miller's a tight end, but now shifted into the backfield. Wilson standing back in the shotgun, ready for the snap. Working that left side. Just had to avoid the sack. Incomplete. That time, awesome job by avoiding the sack by the quarterback. Gets out of trouble. Gets outside. Hey, even though he doesn't get a completion, good job avoiding the negative yards. Russell Wilson has it under center. Going across the middle. Two-minute warning. I don't know what was more terrible. That was a terrible route, terrible throw by the quarterback. Oh, and what a shock. It's incomplete. Screen play is on. In on the stop. Teams in the NFL spend about 30-40% of their time all week long practicing plays in the red zone. So there's a lot they can do here. Let's see if they come up with something that works.
That long gain sets them up here on this play. Lynch going to be a tackle for a loss. Well, the play is there to be made, but the offensive player doesn't get it done. Bad job on first down. From the gun, Russell Wilson ready for the snap. Catch is made, and it's Earl Thomas who brought him down that time. Nice throw that time by the quarterback in the red zone. Gets a completion, and there's some tight spots. Not a lot of room, so you got to really drive the football in there. Seahawks have saved all three of their timeouts for here in the fourth quarter. down here. Lynch has got it on the handoff. Well, when you have a tie game and you're down in the red zone, you can do whatever you want. You can fool them with the run here, or you can take a chance and throw the football in the end zone to get a score. The Seahawks coming to the line. They'll have all three of their timeouts here in the fourth quarter. Dan picks up about three. If I'm on the defense, and the offense is this close to scoring, I'll tell you what I'm doing. I am sending everybody. I am going to gamble that it is a run. If they have the courage to throw it, let them. If they do, of course it'll be a touchdown. Pressure kick coming up here. The Seahawks are going to burn the first of their three timeouts right here. Chip shot here. got to take advantage of good field position. The offense doesn't do it that time. I know they get three points out of it. Nice kick, but still a letdown for the offense. He's in the clear. Touchdown! You just knew this.